close to a dozen volunteers and friends coming together to move everything from boxes to heavy equipment in the rain. They wouldn't be here if not for a Mekanaka, a former Thunder player and avid volunteer in the Tulsa community. Yeah. Naka tells us this month has been a challenge. His primary caregiver and father broke his ankle, and his only form of transportation was totaled. That helped me do so much. I was able to finish school, go to work, um, and so to have that, to lose that independence, that was a big gut punch. He was shocked on Wednesday to find his home in ashes, but Naka now plans to rise with high hopes for what comes next. I'm in that dark season as a cocoon. And I'm about to take off again like a butterfly and fly. So I know that you know, it's a new season, a new job, new car, new house. Um, I'm embracing all the good with the bad. He feels encouraged as this community gathers around him. Oh, see? Oh, 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 Come on, guys. Oh, 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 the is coming down. We got to get out. They continued to pack up belongings even as the ceiling started to fall. When he's faced with obstacles like this, just looking at the bright side. Like he has friends, he has family, he's loved and he will overcome. It's these same friends that will take care of Naka in the weeks ahead as he waits for temporary housing. That gives me great perspective to know that I'm not in this by myself. I, I do not do life on my own. Um, when things like this happen, it just gives me another chance to, to have faith in other people and see what they can do uh, with me. A GoFundMe was created to help with transportation and a new home for Naka to move forward. For more information, just go to KGRH.com. Reporting in Tulsa, Megan Allison, Two Works For You.